More than 36 million jobless claims have been filed in the last two months. One effect of that unemployment is the number of people who could lose their employer-sponsored health insurance. Contact 2's Mike Colombo has information on new data showing Missourians could be among the biggest losers. At least three unemployment scenarios we looked at was a 10% unemployment scenario, a 17.5%, and on the high end, 25% unemployment. Adam Johnson is a research analyst for Quote Wizard. He says his team examined data from Health Management Associates. It estimated the number of people who will lose employer-sponsored health insurance, qualify for Medicaid, and the number of people who could go uninsured. The most recent data from the Department of Labor shows 17.9 percent of Missouri's workforce has filed an unemployment claim since March 1st. According to Quote Wizard's medium unemployment scenario, 491,000 Missourians could lose their employer-sponsored health care due to COVID-19 layoffs. More than 222,000 Missourians could be left uninsured. In a state like Missouri that did not participate in expansion, uh, that eligibility based on income is lower. Johnson says states that did not expand Medicaid through the Affordable Care Act will be hardest hit with uninsured people. Covering those costs of uninsured people is quite an economic burden. While Congress designated $100 billion in CARES Act funding for hospitals and other health care services, the Kaiser Family Foundation estimates health care costs for the uninsured could amount to $40 billion. With such a large portion of the funding going to covering the uninsured, other entities in the bill could go underfunded. Long term, it could increase the cost of health care. We'll be watching. I'm Mike Colombo reporting.